John Wesley and Lucy Gregson are my grandparents. John Wesley Gregson was an apple rancher. He also liked to grow roses. He grew 10 acres of mostly Gravenstein apples in Grayton. Here he's driving his old case tractor to plow and harrow the apple orchards during the winter. Lucy Gregson was the president of the Sebastopol branch of the American Fuchsia Society and could also drive the tractor. David Moreland, my cousin, was always fun to be around. He had a great sense of humor. And his sister Mary had a pony named Nellie and took us on pony rides around the pastures. Glenn and Jeanette Moreland are my aunt and uncle. They're a great family. Lucy May at Christmas 56 and her husband Sam Powell. That's me, Jimmy Gregson, catching a fish and getting a book from Grandma at Christmas. This is my older brother, Richard Gregson, and my father, George Gregson, who took all these movies between 1948 and 1971. Two weeks ago, Dad came over here and sat with me in this living room, and he showed the movies with his old Bell & Howell projector uh, into the video transfer box and so all these uh all these movies were laid down were laid down on the tape by george gregson and he was so pleased that he finally had him on video he was thrilled yeah he was because these were his uh what he called good times with grandma right and he wanted to wanted to get those put on tape so we could make copies for our friends and relatives uh, now this is the, the old Bell & Howe projector we bought back in 1947 along with this camera, 8mm camera, and we've got pictures of all the Gregson family and we're going to start showing them to you in just a minute. This is the first shot there. And I believe we're going to see possibly, oh uh, that's, that's Greg. Okay, the year is 1948 at Grayton. And that is Rick, little Rick, and Johnny. Johnny. Johnny, Johnny yeah. Stewart. A uh, big fat cat. Yeah, somebody's cat. Somebody's <laughs> kitty cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah kitty cat, kitty Stevie. Cat. And little baby Jim. Mm -hmm. Little baby Jim. Little, kitty I mean, cat. look. Right. Yeah. Oh, there's Merle, Merle and, Merle and, and Johnny. Johnny. And there's Mary Ellen and Jim. I'm trying to hold him up there. Yeah, <laughs> Looks right. like yeah. he probably yeah, can't. I wasn't walking too good right then. No, you were probably weren't walking. Period. There's huh? Granddad yes. in his famous bib overalls. Yep. Love those overalls. Oh, Sparky. And Sparky. Stevie, come see his doggy. Look, <laughs> Rick, what are you trying to do to Sparky? <laughs> trying to give him a, a lube job or something. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe things is... Pick him up, you know. Oh, he's so sweet. <laughs> yeah, he's a sweet He was pie. a nice dog. He never he was very patient. Yeah. He never bothered children, yeah. you know, snapped at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, he's only on one, one leg. Oh, <laughs> and there's Grandma yep. and Louise. Louise. Little baby Jim. I'm sorry, I just have to go out for a minute. <laughs> well, he's giving Grandma their love. <laughs> oh, those beautiful fuchsias. He really did have an art. A amazing the fuchsias. fuchsias. A yes. variety of colors. She certainly so. did. <sighs> Yeah, because I've tried growing fuchsias and I found out how hard they are to well, this get them to grow and bloom. It's drier down she here. She uh, bought, uh, brought us some in her car. Every house we live, three different homes, homes, and they're still they're still there in the Los Altos house. George and I drove by recently, and they're still out in oh, the, for out the front porch. Oh, there's 
There's Grandpa spraying. Yep. He was uh, probably back in putting the on copper sulfate to reduce the mold. And then some of the other times he used lead arsenate or DDT. Oh boy. Some really potent stuff. That I wonder he lived as long as he did, huh? <laughs> Many of which are now banned or illegal. But he did raise nice apples. Yeah. Yep. Or wonderful yep. apples. But one year they had an attack of tent caterpillars. Oh, I don't remember that. Yeah, they were those nasty. Tent caterpillars uh, just put big webs all over the apple trees and kills they the were, branches. Yeah. They were yeah. trying to sp spray them to get rid of them. Oh, there's oh. Rosemary. She looks so yeah. pretty. Mm -hmm. Yep, this is at Rosemary's house in Forestville. Boy, I sure had a pretty view there, kind of up on a hill. Oh, there's Sylvia. Yeah. And Rosemary always has something to talk about. Oh, yeah. Uh, always. Was that Rick and... Yeah, that's, and that's Rick, Rick and John. 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 Rick and John. No, no, I think that was and Sylvia. Boy, Sylvia must be just about one. Cause Look she at that yeah, she's toddling along. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Her little tongue. <laughs> Oh, that's a nice picture. Mm -hmm. that, those were the daisies she, she bit the tops out of. <laughs> yeah, she has one in her hand. There's the proof. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, the solar dryer. Right. Yep. <laughs> Boy, she could even had pulleys at both ends so she could pull them along. Didn't have to walk so much. Love those yeah. dark glasses on Mom. There yeah. Well, that's John, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's yep. John. John. And Rick. That's John and Sylvia. Oh, what a Now, beach. this was at Jenner, Jenner. Jenner by the Sea, which isn't oh, that right? Oh, there's Mom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Isn't that right near oh, where the Russian me. River comes out to the ocean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it is. Awesome. Yeah. Oh. Everybody's going to dig in the sand and uh, find a place to jump because there were sand dunes and big logs to jump on. Boy, it was windy. Oh, oh look yes. at that, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> David. That That's quite a ways down there. Yeah, yeah. For a little had tiny. Had to think about it. <laughs> <laughs> and changed his mind. Probably <laughs> wise. <laughs> This is down by the Russian River, probably just, you know, if we came back from Jenner, just back up the road from Jenner, where it was coming down a gorge. I remember one time I burned my feet uh, on, the rocks? on the rocks at Russian River. I walked barefooted across the, you know, the, the tidal the beach. plain, flood plain, and it was in the heat of the day in summer, and it just fried the bottom of my feet. Uh -huh. Yep, I, I remember that. It was about a hundred yard walk across. About a hundred yard walk and I got out in the middle and I realized I was in big trouble. <laughs> and I, I just ran as fast as I could. I don't think we had to do anything about it though. No, it, just, it wasn't that bad. Oh, well, looks like you were taking it easy there. Yep. Oh, those beautiful redwood trees. This is, this is a trip going to Oregon and on the way up we went through the redwoods and this is Richardson Grove. I think this is where we stayed one night. We didn't camp that night. It says honeymoon stayed. something there. Yeah, honeymoon trail. Honeymoon trail. Oh. But it was a little, uh, little set of cottages. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. oh, there's a nice cataract. Near Richardson Grove. I remember the Redwoods made a profound impression on me because it was years before I got a chance to go back yet when I did, it was the same feeling of these these awesome trees, you know, where you'd look up and they seemed to go forever. And, and they'd quiet. been there forever, yeah, too. Yeah, they'd been there forever, and the, the quiet of the trees. 
you know, one of the tragedies that is that they, some of those trees, uh, when they would hit the ground, that they were so big they would just kind of shatter and splinter into pieces. So they, a lot of them, they didn't even get much usable wood out of them when they chopped them down. Mm. really gets dark in between the yeah. Yeah. Does. and the daytime. Are these rhododendrons or what did we I decide? I think that's what we decided. That reminds me of dogwood, really. Yeah, that's what I was thinking dogwood. And those are lupins? Yep. Some kind of lupin. Yeah, it was just uh, two weeks ago, when, two or three weeks ago, when Dad was showing these movies to me and he told me that those were lupins. Oh, look at the logs. Look at the logs. These Huge were original, logs. you know, old growth, probably redwoods. Look at them fall look off. Them the, fall look off at, into the water. Look at that. And then the guy would pull them and get them into position. Then they'd get out there and walk on them a lot of times. Yep. It's falling down. Yeah, they they had cut those down and they're putting them in the pond before they get ready to cut them. See, look that at that. That looks like look fur. It may be for some, yeah. some of it is. Yeah, it's too, it's too wide inside. Yeah, look at this. Look at the big splash. I can't believe they let us just walk around like that. And here they're, <laughs> yeah. they're dropping this trailer on the back of the. Uh, uh, I must have been oh, keeping a watchful eye. Swinging around. Yeah. There they go on the train. Got a train and it's got logs Look on it. Look at the old teepee burner. Mm -hmm. I like the wind in a teepee. Now, David oh, used to call those salt and pepper shakers. Oh, yeah. Some, yeah. some would put out white smoke and others would put out black smoke. Yeah, he's, smoke. At, he's, he's walking on that log. He's using I think that was David's name. Oh. <laughs> see, and then they're going up and they're going into the sawmill to be cut. Because now those azaleas? I don't well, know. I don't see uh, they might have been because those leaves are those 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 small. small. They're azaleas. It looks the like azalea. Again. Now the logs are gone. Were they wild? Yeah, those are wild azaleas yeah. that were just growing. Yeah, that's out there in the azalea. forest, because those azaleas like a nice cool climate with lots of shade, or not too much direct sunshine. Gorgeous. That's that 49-Ford again. This is probably, as we're getting, there's, you know, there's some meadows as you get close oh, to some Eureka. Elks. And so I think this is some, some of these meadows where we've seen this elk. Would that be Prairie Creek? There are always elk there. Yeah, it could be. And the road just the road kind of just runs right through there. Yeah. They feed them out there in that meadow to make sure they stay where where they can be seen. Oh really? Oh, what yeah. are they feeding? Hay. Hay. Oh, they just put hay out there in the winter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we're still in the redwoods. We're not mm -hmm. out of it yet. And this has got to be Eureka. Yeah, I'm sure that's where it is. Yeah. Granddad. Well, it must have been a cold day. Yeah, right. Yeah, jacket collar up. I think Eureka is always cold. When we were there in the summer yeah. a few years ago, it was it was even freezing Fog. and foggy yeah. oh, in the middle of the summer. Yeah. It's a wonderful place to go. I love Eureka. I would want to yeah. stay there, though, if it was foggy and cold. Like you ever see the sunshine there? Yes. Oh, yeah, oh. absolutely. Yes. I think it's a neat town. Well, ground, Grandpa was really catching fish that day, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, it was. Now, that looked like it might have been salmon. I bet he was thrilled. I bet they were all thrilled. Really fought. Yeah, they were. Looks like there about five pounders or that is not a salmon. That's not a salmon. No, it's like got a big mouth. Like a, yeah. It's 
snapper or something. Somebody took a picture of George. Yeah, yeah right. George. Yeah. Maybe the captain right. on the ship did it. Yeah. Always oh, catching a big one. Yeah. What are y'all looking at? Yep, wonder what's way up there. Yeah. Oh, I love Grandma's hair like that. Yeah, yeah. I like, I like it's beautiful. Like that. Oh, the rhododendrons. Those were rhododendrons. They, they're the same color as the azaleas, but the leaves oh. are quite a bit bigger. Well, rhododendrons come in all colors, really. Yeah. Lots of colors. Well, those little squirrels seem to be real brave there. Yeah. Yeah, this, I think we're at, this is Oregon Caves. This is like the, uh, like the ranger station at Oregon Caves. These squirrels, they are going to take us for everything they can get. All right. <laughs> Stuffing their little yeah, cheeks with faces. that. Get some blue jays in there. Yeah, the, the blue jays, and they're going to fight the squirrels and chipmunks for anything they can find. <laughs> yes, the chipmunk though, he's he's chasing that jay off. And I think this is the road where you walk up to the cave, and then Grandma and Granddad and Dad went down inside, and we stayed outside, Mom. Yeah, Jim and Jim and I. Outside. Yeah, who knows? There might be bats or something in there. Yeah, right. Oh, it was just it was dark and long. And well, there's your dad. Yeah, and that shirt. Yeah, yep, right. Yeah, yeah. Favorite striped shirt. Shirts. I think he got that shirt for Christmas. <laughs> that has a light meter. You know, always has a light meter. Right yeah. Right. I love you know see the 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 levels in the snow. You know, you yeah. can see the different snowfalls and how yeah. it's compacted. You can see it's a lot of days of snow there. Crater it's Lake. Crater Lake. The color of Crater Lake was always so incredible. The sky was so blue and then the water was always such a deep, Oh yeah, and it still is. Blue. And it is a fantastic place. Building a, yeah, snowman. Dad's building a snowman. Yeah, Dad took us to the snow quite a few times, uh, up to the local mountains too, like the Snow Valley, and we built snowmen and went on sleds. And the thing is, we 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 had snow boots, and we would go into snow three foot deep, and our snow boots would fill up. And <laughs> there were snow boots. There were rain, rain, red, red rubber rain red, boots. Red, yeah, <laughs> rain boots. Boy, I tell you what, that's a, a surprise when you get your boots full of snow. Did you say that was a 49 Ford? Yeah. Yeah, which they bought new. And that 49 Ford took us to Florida. Um, probably the either that same summer or the next summer. And this is Lad Canyon in Oregon. This is where grandmother's father had homesteaded just after they got off the Oregon Trail from Nebraska. And there is There's the old picture. Stein Ranch. Oh. See, George has you know, a beautiful picture oh, he got yeah. off of that one yeah. little slide. Yes. That's right. That's that's one fantastic. little frame out of the movies. That out of the movie? Up. Yeah, out oh. of this yeah. right here. Yeah. This is very good. Oh, that's pretty. Yep, they had traveled the Oregon Trail right about 1905 in a covered wagon oh. from Nebraska. And at the end of the Oregon Trail, this looked like a real nice spot. Yeah. 
so that's where they homesteaded. Okay, and now we're at the Columbia River. This is a local Indian, and he's going to show us his catch of fish. Oh, boy. They caught a lot. And the Indians were the only ones that were allowed to net fish on the river. That's because they had ancient fishing rights that were granted to them by the government. see him netting, netting salmon here. Yeah, I think we saw the fish ladders there too. Yeah. Um, and they're going to show them again, I think. Your dad will show them again. Beautiful yeah. picture of the Columbia. Yeah. Some of and those dams. Are, this is maybe like the Dowels. You know, there's as you go down yeah, the Columbia. The I think the Dowels is another big development where they have the fish ladders. And they also have some gardens there. Yeah, but last summer when we went there, it looked it looked real dry. Really? Yeah, there weren't any gardens anywhere that we huh. could see. And they were saying that those dams on the Columbia provide a lot of the energy for the Los Angeles area, even. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, you could. Just look at all that power. Yeah. It's an incredible river. Yeah, these, now, I, again, this is, I kept seeing when we were there, you know, these flower beds, you know, near the dams. Now, this is Multnomah Falls. Oh. <laughs> Boy, Mom's really, yeah, yeah, she's really, she's really hustling. Yeah, she's really hustling. <coughs> it's a beautiful waterfall. Yeah, it's, it's the bridge in particular, the way the bridge crosses over at about the halfway point. It's such a spectacular. That's a that's beautiful a pretty picture. picture. Yeah. Oh, that's, oh, that's a great one. I wish George had thought yes. of getting that one. I don't know why he didn't. Know. Is it still possible to get them? Yeah, yes. but yeah. not everybody can do it. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if Jim can do it. I don't know how you do it, really. I love the way Grandma used to cook uh, cook breakfast when we'd early. camp in a grove. And it really wouldn't be that early. I think it would maybe be like 8 o'clock or yeah, something like that. Yeah, it wasn't really. But well, Jim just woke up. There'd be so little sunlight in the grove itself that it would still look kind of dark and it would be cool. And uh, But she always cooked a great breakfast. Yeah. I'm feeding Jim a piece of bacon. Yeah. <laughs> well, I had their aviator catch yeah, them nice yeah, early yeah. in the morning. <laughs> well, that was probably kind of chilly. See, I got my kind of heavy sweater on. Uh -huh. I have and another pancake. Right out of a bottle, yeah. <laughs> and Granddad always had his hat on when he was traveling. He was <laughs> You'd see him with it off every now and then at home, but when he was traveling, he had to have his hat. I love the smoke and the mist and the redwoods. It's sort of spectacular. Yeah, with the light filtering yeah. through the trees. Yeah. Just yeah. Yeah. And you've got you've got, got an air job. pump there. I don't know what you were doing with it, but you got. Well, we probably had it out pumping up. Yeah, an air mattress or yeah, something. Yeah, like that. probably so. Uh -huh. He probably just played yeah. with it. I think Dad's going off to do some fishing. Oh, yeah, looks like it. Yep. Yeah, that was his standard way of carrying fishing poles. I remember yep. him going off on a lot of fishing trips. Yeah, out the window. So now we're back in great. And look at those roses. Gosh. She had every kind of flower there, didn't she? Yeah, yeah she did. I mean, you start looking. She really had a green thumb. Well, it yeah. was her art form. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah Truly. Really. It was. I mean, she, yeah, she could. What a green thumb she was. She could grow anything. Oh, wasn't she the president David. of the Fuchsia Society yeah, yeah, there in Sonoma County? Right, right. Mm -hmm. And here we are. This is oh. Anchor Bay. Well, who is this? Is this Rick? That's yeah, Rick? that's, that's mm -hmm. me. Yeah, this is, we're at 1952 now. 
Oh, and there's David. And, and we, okay, what, we spent a whole week there at Anchor Bay? Is that right? I see. It was okay. wonderful. It was a it week. Was nice. Yeah, a week. I love, I love the way these logs had been thrown back up in this little bay on the beach, just like matchsticks or something like that. From, By the water. You know, By the yeah, water. They, they would float out to sea oh, that was on the so ocean. Their little dog. dog. And then during a storm, they'd be thrown back. I don't remember. Oh, that's the world. Yes. Do you remember seeing this the last go round? Yeah, I did. We talked about that. Yeah. How that was their dog. Oh, I did. Sylvia. Maybe I'd go in the restaurant. Yeah. That's cute. Isn't Sylvia. It? I remember. Yeah, oh, they really. That is a great shot. That's of, a good uh, shot of uh, Merle and Rosemary. Yeah. <laughs> well, they had, they had a happy marriage. They did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice oh, <laughs> taking it easy, and I was really getting <laughs> yep. covered. Look at those abalones. What? Okay, how how far out did they have to go to get those anyway? Were they just on the rocks? Well, they go for they wait for a real low, low minus tide. tide. Oh, I think oh. it was an extremely low tide. Yeah. But they did get real wet, and yeah. cold when they went out. To they get got wet. That's a great they picture. Oh, we were having a good no. time sliding down yeah, the hillside. Right, right. And this was the, the best fun of all, fishing down through the logs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love that. I thought it was so incredible that, you know, the stream, the stream would come right down through there and you could see the little fish. A green hat you got yeah. on, Jim. Oh, teeny uh, little yeah. fish. Well, both of them got a green hat yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> we, uh, little green hat. Well, you dressed us alike a lot. Yeah. You know, we, yeah. were, we were close enough in yeah. size that... And Grandma oh, she's sure proud. Really good. Oh, look, look yeah, Sylvia, she is so cute. That's a cute yeah. picture. Oh. Little bull heads. Yep. Yep, and it's amazing that we could catch fish on a, a stick with a line tied to the end. Yep. And that's a trout. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's a cute picture. Yeah, baby trout. Ten inches, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> now it's sure good to Stevie out there yeah. in the backyard. He's yeah. getting some. That's nice. Oh, yeah. This, okay, this is camp back in the grove there at Anchor Bay. And, you know, that's Dad's. And you, I think. Uh, well, all three oh, of us. Mary, 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 and, and, Mary, Mary and, and Sylvia and me. Sylvia and that's and Dad's, uh, yeah. oh, maybe hammock. That's the fire where Grandma heated that rock to yeah, cure David's is. earache. Hmm. I guess Grandma's oh, holding Jim, I think. Well, there you are, Lucy. Roasting marshmallows. <laughs> Did you boil that water, Mom? No, I didn't boil it. <laughs> Nobody um, told me to. Yeah, it. <laughs> but it was probably good. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I got water I those days, it was way up there. Nobody had, you know, it was yeah. pretty pure. Yeah, that stream came right out of the mountains, and there was virtually nobody living back there in those mountains. Yeah. And this, I loved, I loved canoeing there at Maribel. Those uh, those old Grumman aluminum canoes were practically indestructible, but yeah. they sure were fun. Oh, there we go with the bathing. Yeah, you're gonna take mom out. You were gonna take her out and yeah. take her on an adventure. <laughs> Did a pretty good job. Yeah. Right. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, there was an expert. Yeah, just you know, look at the hair. Look at that hairy chest. You know, this boy. Look, you know. Well, he still had hair in his chest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, me hamming it up for yeah. the camera. That's Grandpa. And Grandpa with the net. Look him up here. Yep. He could. He could skip a stone, you know, five, six times. Now I guess we're back in. Back to the camp. roses and a yeah. bee. The bee. No, I think. I think it's a ladybug. It's no, a, that's uh, bigger than that a, bee. a bee. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah it was a bee. Ladybugs are small, tiny. Maybe you can latch the screen, Rick. Well, it didn't get it latched. Yeah, it was a real treat to get to take care of her flowers when she was gone. Yeah, they were such beautiful. There's Grandma and Jack again. That's a great picture. That yeah, is a cute one. We have one very similar with the two of them looking yes, towards us up in the living room. She 
She loves yeah. the grandchildren. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> and she usually came to visit us every time one of our children were born. She and Grandpa was helping yeah. pick off all the old blossoms. Oh, that's what he's doing. Yeah, he's picking right. off the old ones. Yeah. Well, he's got his hat off. Yeah, he yeah. does. I like that curly hair, you know, the mm -hmm. little, little parted down the middle with the two little waves. It's are those boys and berries? That's where she's eating the boys and yeah. berries yes. out of the bowl. <laughs> he puts one in and she takes one out. <laughs> <laughs> she's kind of tickled about that. <laughs> he thought it was funny too. <laughs> Maybe she got full of them. <laughs> oh, there's some of those lovely fuchsias. Yeah. All the different colors. Yeah. Now that looks like it's down under the trees, or it looks you can maybe see one of those big trees. It probably is. Back under there. It's Uncle mm -hmm. Dale. There's Dale. Yeah. And that's Sylvia. Sylvia. Yeah. We stayed we stayed with them one year and had a great time. Oh, it's probably the year that we went up. Steve, Steve Davis. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How old how old were they then, you figure? What they were in their 60s or 70s? Maybe 70s? Probably 70s. Yeah. At least. Yeah. Late 70s, maybe. <laughs> well, Uncle Dal was lived to be up in his 90s. Yeah. Oh, did he? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, they lived, they grew up in the years when there weren't all those pesticides right, and things. Right, right. Mm -hmm. That's very true. Oh, we have a dear friend right across the street from us, or, and he's 90, 90, um, Oh, two. this is a whole family. Yeah, this has got to be family after reunion. Sunday. This is Great. like after church. Yeah, it's probably. Here's Mama. Mama yeah, trying to get David Matt. out in front. Yeah. Dad. Yeah. Back there. Glenn. David keeps hiding behind somebody. Johnny. Uh, <laughs> Johnny. I think we had dinner yeah. at Aunt Jen's house that night. Jack. Is that Jack? Oh. Yeah, that's that Jack. Mary. Yeah. And that's me. Yeah. <laughs> Pretending I'm an army guy. David. Sylvia. She was, oh, she was pretty. That's a one of rare George. pictures of Dad and Jack. Somebody took that picture. <laughs> yeah. I probably did. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uncle Dale. Daddy. 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 The gopher trap. They came, came down to visit us a number, number of times. Yeah. In Southern California? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we took them to the Queen Mary, you know. Oh. Our church starts in 15 minutes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ours does too. I never miss on Sunday night <laughs> well, usually, but I guess well, it's an guess exception. It's yeah, right. Well, this might be more important. It is important. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't. Yeah, this is. This will go down a long, long number of years. Oh, but, okay, now, are those Those are camellias. Camellias, she had them right <clears throat> there by the porch of really? the old house. That porch was wonderful. Oh, oh I love yeah, that porch. Oh, yeah, nice big porch. Yeah. So many games could be played yes. out there. And, and, uh, oh, yes, I, yeah, it was, yeah, it was just, the house felt sheltered. Mm -hmm. with, with big trees. And the big the trees and all the hanging baskets and the camellias. I remember how the dog used to scratch on the window while we were eating yes. dinner. Yes. Yeah, I'd get up there and scratch. <laughs> I love that big, the big room with the uh, the dining table, you know, when the kitchen over was, in the corner. Uh -huh. Yeah, it was the kitchen. Do you remember the stair landing? Yeah. We all, all the kids ate on the stair landing. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was just an interesting house the way it was set up. I guess it was Dad told me that well, it was interesting for, then. <laughs> for, because because Grandma the lived there. The kitchen was the original house. Oh, apple blossoms. Oh, Aren't the they beautiful? The was added on? Yes. Oh, I see. It was a, a cabin. <laughs> so this must yeah. have been in April. There were apple blossoms out there and camellias. Mm -hmm. Oh, gosh. Out the bedroom window. the apple blossoms. Yep, that's looking out that up, upstairs bedroom window. Yeah. Rick and I used to sleep in an old double bed up there that, uh... Sway back double bed. 
<laughs> it had springs that had kind of gone soft and had a big uh, dip in the middle, so both of us would yeah. roll towards the middle and then fight each other all night. And that house had that interesting smell. It had the smell of being out in the middle of an apple orchard. It was yeah. the smell of yeah, dust, it did. the smell of you know the apples and, and the, the pollen and the. Uh, it was a great smell, though. It was. Uh, it also great. had the smell of beeswax yes, because the yes, bees that built right. a hive built, in the yeah, attic one summer. The hive. Yeah. They got a lot of honey out of that hive. I yeah, believe. they got honey. Yeah, but you could smell it. You could during the summer. You could smell the smell of the honey, you mm -hmm. know, between the woodwork. Oh, Grandma had dahlias too. Yes. In addition to fuchsias. And wild cats, lots of wild cats. But she didn't have mice. No. Yeah, I, that took I, care I of them. Yeah, I'm sure. And those cats would eat anything. I remember that. I remember her walking down the stairs, and and throwing you know the leftovers from breakfast in this little pile. And you could smell it, you know, it was this, this kind of sweet smell of this stuff that they would eat, you know, pancakes and eggs and anything oatmeal, she anything, fixed. yeah. Grandma. That's a, oh, that's a beautiful picture. That's a lovely picture. Look yes, at those that huge is. dahlias. Those huge dahlias. Oh, Georgie's pool. Yeah, and that was, I remember the thing was almost like sandpaper. The, yeah, the, the bottom. The bottom of it But I learned rough. to swim in that pool. Yeah. <laughs> I learned to worked. swim there. <laughs> but didn't he, he just had a track, he had a tractor with a. Uh, it was a great big. A, bu a bucket on the front. No, it no. wasn't a bucket. It was a. Oh. What are those called? Oh, yeah, big yeah, things, yeah, yeah. A blade. Just a blade. yeah, a big blade in the front. Gloria Jimmy and Davis Jimmy and Davis. Gloria. They were cute. <laughs> they were really good looking. Yeah. They still There's are. There's Louise. Yes. Louise looking like a... Yep. Like a baby hmm. beauty. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, who is that in front of her, one of you guys? I see the Rick or Jim? No, it wasn't. It was one of the... Oh, was it Steve? Boys. Yeah. Steve Davis. Yeah. They were good looking kids, you know, yeah. just a whole bunch of them. Well, Steve is a distinguished scientist now at, I've, yeah, I've at heard, Pepperdine. I've heard that. Would that be Dean? Oh, yeah, I think that's Dean Little Davis. All I know is that there wasn't another swimming pool anywhere close. There so. wasn't another swimming pool around in that yeah, day. That was awfully nice. You have to drive to Sebastopol. Oh, there's little yeah, Susan. Right. Yes. Gloria's yes. holding on yes. to Susan. Yep, and Gloria's still beautiful. I saw her a few years ago. Oh, really? Yep. That is a mean trick. Yes. That's yeah, bold. somebody was so being mean. There's Jim. <laughs> Oh, there's Nellie. Yes, there's Nellie. That's Jim. I always thought that was so exciting that somebody we knew had, had a horse. horse. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we were lucky. Yes. Yeah, we were. I remember that's that. Rick's turn. That would be like the highlight of the whole weekend. Just get the light on Nellie. Patna, she doesn't seem to mind. Oh, she liked that. Yeah, I bet she did. That's <laughs> cute of you. <laughs> he thinks, he it's, thinks great. it's funny. Oh, there's Nellie. Yeah. <laughs> that was a little banny rooster. The Davises had bannies. Oh. Oh, David's on the pony now, bareback. Yeah, and me. And yeah, bareback was kind of fatal. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> you, you'd get four kids or five on the on her back, bareback. Oh, she didn't like and that. She would trot right. and then put her right. head down. Yeah, and you could slide off the front. <laughs> oh. <laughs> now this is, this is the fishing hole that I remember more than anything about catching fish, because there were there were. Lots of That's fish in the river. Look at these little tiny 
and they just bought those poles for us for that trip. Yeah, bamboo poles. Yeah, bamboo poles. Double, and they were those were uh, jointed bamboo poles, so they could be taken apart. Mary. In cold water. That yes. was cold water. It was cold water. Yep, nobody wants to get wet all over. Nope, uh-uh. Boy, I'll tell you what, that would be too much to handle. There's a sandbar out at the mouth of Big River. You walk out to that sandbar and around the point, and there's a quite a good-sized cave. Really? But you don't want to get caught out there. No, because the water coming up would probably uh, drown you or something. Well, you'd have to climb the cliff in a hurry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bombing that enemy ship out there. Is Grandma going to make a fire? Yeah. Driftwood. Her apron. Driftwood. You can't pick that up for a fire now. <laughs> Looks like no. Tim's got a loader that rig. Mm -hmm. yeah. Somebody's getting a hug. I miss Jack, so I'm just leaving. Building a fort. <clears throat> Yep, trying to keep Jack's little ears yeah. warm there. <laughs> Must be getting pretty warm, taking his hat and jacket yeah. off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> look at hot those dogs. hot dogs. Yep, how many hot dogs can you get on one stick? Yeah. It's a good There's picture a, of Mary. Yeah. Well, no, no, look at this. It's the original corn dog, see? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's corn and hot dogs. Granddad Eaton. I remember he always had to be eating something to keep his stomach settled. That corn looks oh, good. Yeah, corn, corn was, was good. It was fresh corn. And okay, <laughs> here, this and this is the famous place. The little, it's like a little pier, and there was a million perch underneath, and you could put one little cheese ball down and catch five fish on one little cheese ball, uh -huh. <laughs> or even a bear hook. It was incredible. I wonder if we ate those fish. Oh, there's nice picture. There's Your dad. Yeah. David. 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 Yeah, Without Dave, his glasses. Yeah, yeah he didn't have his glasses Ford out on. in the field or out in the orchard. I wonder if he'd broken them or lost them or something. Who was that larger boy? Larger than David. There was one there? I didn't see him. Maybe a cousin? Okay, now this, what month would this be? Have to be oh, January. Oh, it be January or February. In February yeah. you have a little bit more green out. Oh, so January. Had to be January. Yep, they prune the trees and then yeah. burn the brush. It used to be. And I remember the next morning there would just be a pile of ashes, but there would be live coals down there in the bottom of those oh, ashes. Oh, right. And you could start the next day's fire. Just from just those coals. Yes, yeah, that's coals. right. Oh, there was that sled. Yeah, we love that sled. That was a, that was really neat being able to right on the back of the sled. I scattered a lot of apple boxes yeah. off of that sled. I did too. And loaded I full ones on it too. What what'd they yeah. call the big apple box? You know the big ones. The lug. A lug. A lug. Yeah. yeah. Fifty pounds. No, no, I mean the ones. No, the big ones. The ones that was like about three foot high and about oh. three foot square. What do they call those things? They put. Were they crates or? Yeah, like a they, big. Oh, no, they, there's another word. A bin. Yes. Bin. Yeah. yeah. One time, we oh, were gathering apples, and I stood in the bin, and they poured apples all around me. And I was oh, up to my waist in apples. <laughs> well, even Grandma was out there helping yeah. with the brush. Yeah, oh, she always did. Mm -hmm. With her dress on. 
Yeah, she probably, never wore yes. pants. She always wore a dress. That, that right. wore, ladies didn't wear ladies pants in those days. Yes. <laughs> the first time I got pants, well, I mean, it was your my generation. Dad was kind of yours, against it. yours was probably the first generation yeah. that did yeah, it. Yeah, ours was the first generation pants. that yeah. wore pants. Well, it was Jack quite a victory to convince my yes. dad it was okay. He didn't, he well, I didn't thought like that was it. because of work. I thought, I thought big. I thought, like, you know, when you were at Douglas, you wore pants, didn't you? Oh, yeah, yeah. I yeah. had some cute little coveralls. Yeah, I know. They were cute. Mm -hmm. Got a picture of me in my lunch bucket opening the little, little door right down at that house. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, Look at that. Oh, oh, Grandpa. All the boys huh? around me. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Because we stayed yeah. there long enough that, you know, they wouldn't get acquainted with him. You know, yeah. Sparky. It's getting gray oh, there. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Is that John? One of the yes, red striped yeah. shirt. Mm -hmm. He was a sweet dog, though. Didn't he have, he had a cut right across his nose. Who? Maybe Sparky. later. Sparky did? No, yeah. Granddad well, probably had, held, he had, up. had run over him when he was disking. Oh, you know? no. And, yeah, and he, had a, he had a scar across oh. his nose. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. I guess it healed up a oh, yeah, All those apple no, blossoms it, it are so it just, pretty you know, there. It was just kind of a surface thing. But, uh, oh, those are so beautiful. Oh, kids. <laughs> Sparky's slightly happy to see Granddaddy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. He was just, he was a neat dog. He was a good dog. I think he was Rosemary's dog originally. He was oh, originally, yeah. but she had she, to go be with Merle and left him with Grandpa. Yeah, she was, yeah. when she lived at home, I guess she did. I love it. The way that tractor had, you know, those, those fenders, you <laughs> know, so yeah. the trees would just, you know, he'd go he'd right keep through Keep the dust trees. off of you. You yeah. could pull those side things up even higher. Oh, really? To keep from getting uh, hit by the brush. Oh. It didn't do it very often. It wasn't practical. <laughs> now, this is Davis Creek, and it just, it came right out of the hillside below Sullivan Road. And granddad told us that this is where he used to collect arrowheads and stuff like that because the Indians used to camp here. Mm. Yeah, dad has a, a beautiful collection of Indian arrowheads and arrow points. Uh, there must be, I don't know, between 50 and 100. Yeah. I don't know um, if there's that many. Well, right? maybe at least 50. Yeah, but I had very about nice that many once. So I had some that I'd collected from around our place, and then yeah, Glenn that. Winkler gave me a big collection that he had made, and so I had a big collection, and I was going barn. to college, and uh -huh. I loaned it to yeah, Roger Davis, barn. and I never Grandma saw it again. Grandma used to raise oh. chickens oh. upstairs in the yeah. attic of the Roger barn. Davis. Really? Where was he? He uh -huh. was... Uh, it was Roger and Rosalie Davis and was they Edna and really they lay all winter because they never got cold. And, uh, and oh really? Ivan. A big window no, up there and kept them warm. Huh. Oh, there's David with the kite. Yeah, we went down. This, that's cute. Those, that's a nice picture. Those yeah, that's kites a really were nice picture. Chinese kites because they had this. Didn't these dragons Kiwi get married on. the other day? Or was well, she was supposed to get married in August, but we were going to call David tonight. You know. Yeah, we had got those kites coming. down there in the, the little general store yeah. right there in the center of Grayton. Oh, is that Saint Helena in the background? In that picture, <laughs> <laughs> there was a good breeze that day. This is yeah. Easter egg. Easter huh? egg. Oh. That's Samuel right next to Jen. Yeah, right. Now, how, okay, so he's how old there? Um, he must be three because Tommy was. I had Tommy then. Okay, so this now this is Christmas before what? that. Is this Christmas, Christmas of 56? Christmas before that Easter. That's right, Christmas 56. Okay, we're at Grandma's house again. Right? So Jack uh -huh. is three years old. Okay. Because he was born in November uh, 53. Okay. Too bad you didn't get a picture of that That's tree that had those bubble lights. I just love those little yeah. lights. <laughs> There's, There's Mother and Rosemary. Yes. And Merle. David. David. There's me. <laughs> I'm pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Long hair you had With there. Tom. There's yeah, the Fern. Saw that long, beautiful, Scott. really red hair. Yes. Dad. I wonder what package. was in there. It had, it had a, a handle, yeah, a handle <laughs> sticking out. His mother. Mom opened yeah. something good. I, I think that was a little stick horse. Oh, a stick the broom, horse. The broomstick with the horse head on it. And he uh, was helping uh, one of the kids open it. Oh, uh, was that it? Probably so. Jack got a car. Oh, yeah. It's a police <laughs> car. Oh, that's nice. Those were wonderful uh, Christmas. three. Stevie just got a little police car. Mm -hmm. There's Sam. For his third birthday. 
There's Dad with a new blanket. And David's getting a and David's basketball. getting a basketball. Yep. I, I think he hung that hoop on your garage or something. Yeah. Mary. Mary. That's a yeah. great picture, Mary. Mary was that? Was, uh, this is uh, 1956, and uh, oh, I got a bathroom. Yeah. Oh, she's a saucy. Look at that! Look at that! Yeah. Yeah. Look at those yeah. curls. <laughs> yeah. Oh. yeah, I remember Mary had a, a pink poodle skirt and a little tiny record player and some Elvis Presley singles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, I bet they had the great big hole in the yes, center too. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, the big hole yeah, in the center. Yes, in Yeah. Rosemary. That's Mary. That's a pretty picture of Rosemary. Oh, that is a nice picture. Oh, There's that old dog, oh, Bill God. Scott. Oh, is that Bill Scott? Mm. And I think that's Kathy. Yeah. Okay. Fern Scott. Fern and Kathy. Yeah. Rosemary is really giving some opinions yes, there. Well, yeah, she <laughs> yeah, always she had an opinion about something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> Every third year after Every that. Every third year, okay. <laughs> For a long time. How many did you end up with? Seven. Oh. <laughs> but you, you adopted seven, one. Seven, not seven of your own. But six that you had, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. but I was pregnant seven times. Oh, you were? Yes. <laughs> I was. Boy, well, it looks like Merle had gotten hurt or something. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, What's he was in book? construction and in industry. Yeah. Which oh, he, that was our Scrabble set. Oh. That was our Scrabble set. Oh, look at the geyser. Oh, this is Geyserville. Or near Geyserville. Near Geyserville. And yeah. Elsie and Del Davis. And oh, is that lady? <laughs> That well, there's Louise in front of oh, Elsie Davis. Yeah. Oh, that's classy! That's classy! That's classy! Wow. Yeah, Elsie Wonderful. took us on a hike around through the geysers, and this is just before Union Oil capped those geysers, so they were still with their full power blasting off into the air, and you could you can hear you could hear those geysers from miles away. They sounded like a jet engine. Oh yeah, it was incredibly loud. And the smell, you know, the these the sulfur. Sulfur smell. Yeah. It's down, it's down. It's down. And there's Aunt Sylvia, Aunt and she Sylvia. just I couldn't believe that a, a lady that old and that frail could just lead us through this uh, this trail, you know, she through the geysers. Looked frail, but she really no. wasn't frail. Yeah, I know. No, she, she was, wasn't frail. She just kept going. Yeah, she was. She and Grandma were a lot alike. Yeah, and, right. Oh, your cookies are on. Well, they they had to be of that sturdy pioneer stock. Yeah. You know? They had lots of energy. Yeah, they did. Well, they stayed active because, you know, they... That's the faithful one. Sure looks like the faithful one. Just like it? the old faithful. <laughs> <laughs> Not faithful. Yeah, that's a great, that is a great picture. That was a fun I guess I had my hair pulled back. Yeah. That's what it is. That was just, that was one of those days I'll never forget because it was just, you know, the, the geysers are so intense. I'm a geyser. And you're, boy, this was a good day fishing. Well, who's that? That's Jack. Jack. That's Jack. He's growing yeah. up a little bit. Yeah, he, yeah, he caught a fish too. There's Jimmy Graham. Yeah, we're fishing there at the rocks, and this is Bodega Bay. Well, we'll we're, we'll see the guys here later. Look, there's Uncle Jack. He's digging in the sand. He's gonna make a sand castle. Yep, he sure is. Boy, he's got himself. That's a great mountain. cast. Yeah, yeah that was that a great cast. cast. He used to go down to the the casting pool at Recreation Park and show us how. Oh. That's a fishing boat. A fishing boat. Yes, those, oh, those, Davis. those fishing boats go out and catch salmon. Why don't you have this and hook it up to the camera? Because the camera has the the good microphone. Yeah. 
I don't have any other microphones that are better than this one. <laughs> fixing her hair. Yeah, fixing her hair. Typical. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, hey, look at those fish. That was a great day. Yeah, that was a good day. Yep, those are yeah, even man. eaten size. Yeah, yeah, you can actually eat those. Okay, there's a little bit more left here. We got one more last section. And Mine's Oh, Yep, you can't touch the microphone, Stevie, because then you hear a bunch of scratching noises on it. Now, uh, okay, the, the next one here is 1971. And I believe that's Uncle Eldon yeah, and Uncle Aunt Verna. Yeah, Verna. Oh. Mm -hmm. right. That's Joanne Davis's house. Isn't it? Oh, Joanne Davis's house. That's yeah. a beautiful yeah. home. And that really is a nice little place. I guess they still live there, probably. Yeah, that's Joanne. It's Elvin and, and Rosemary. 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 Yeah. Rosemary. Is that Rosemary's house there? Uh, no. I don't know where we are. There's yeah, also Elvin's house. Maybe it's Elsie Pearl's house. Maybe. house maybe. Where is it? Yes. Might be. Yeah, I think I believe it is, is Elsie's house. Probably out in the yard. She's on the dad. Good picture, Verna. Oh, Vincent. there's Vincent. Yep, and these Elvin. are their fishing boats, and we. Going out to see their boats. Yeah. The Roundup, that's one of their. Yeah, Cliff and his wife. Oh, Cliff and his wife. Mm -hmm. I get it. I got it. That's a good picture of Vincent. Yeah, is that Eldon? That's Eldon. Definitely opinionated. Mm -hmm. No question about it. Probably skull. Great deal of somebody. energy involved in that discussion. Yep, so between 1948 and 1971, we had a 23-year span that this particular, these movies cover. Now, who's this? That's Sylvia. Oh, I Sylvia. Yes, it is. Yeah, it is. Uh-huh. Huh. And... Those are, we don't know those little children. Must well, Dad some, knew them. <laughs> yeah, there must be just some friends yeah. or something. Yeah. <clears throat> I never saw Sylvia looking like that. I never did yeah, either. There's, oh, she's got her hair down. That. Yeah, she had it rollers, and she's got it. Well, that was Merle. And there's the old house in Los Gatos. Uh, Dad said that they had just drove by just to see it yeah. and oh, it had changed a quite a bit yeah because this was 1971 and we had left there yeah, uh, yeah, in 1960 yeah, had grown up. now this is sylvia again laura with the daughter laura, laura. Yeah. no that does look like sylvia these are those, that looks like sylvia these are the hippie yeah. years 1970 uh -huh. 71. This is our narration team. We've been sitting here on a Sunday afternoon, and uh, we got Louise Gregson and Mary Fogner, Lucy May Powell, 
<laughs> Richard Gregson. And Stevie Kamara. And, you know, for exclamation points. <laughs> Stevie's been helping us. He's been real interested in the camera equipment. Yes, yeah, right. He's and get, taking a picture. Giving a, a silent direction over here on the side is Alan. Yes. Thank you to Alan for getting us through some of the tough.